Today we're doing a review for the Wild Med Kits.ca first aid kits. So uh, we have the Wilderness first aid kit here. Uh, comes in a nice little package. Plastic, it's a little Ziploc bag, nice and compact. And then we have the comprehensive Wilderness kit here. Um, so Wild Med Kits.ca was uh, gracious enough to send me few kits here to check out. We also have the uh, pocket survival kit and a tourniquet. Um, <clears throat> so there's a couple things that I'm looking for in uh, anything that I carry in the backcountry basically. It's got to be multi-purpose, it's got to be lightweight, compact and serve a purpose obviously. Um, so I just picked these up. I have no clue what I'm really looking at. I'm going to take a quick look at them here and give you my opinion on what I'll be bringing out with me today. So here we have the Wilderness First Aid Kit. Uh, this comes with some gloves, uh, trauma pads, emergency blanket, some gauzes, some minor wound care like uh, fabric bandages for your fingertips, moleskin, alcohol swabs. Comes in a little bag. Uh, triangle, triangular bandage, um, tweezers, first aid scissors, kind of has the basics in this one is what I'm going to say. Um, yeah, we got some tape, some gauze. This one looks like it's pretty reasonable for the size. This one here, uh, a little more comprehensive obviously, hence the name. This is a really nice kit guys. Um, Opens up nice, nice carrying case. That's pretty, pretty key. Uh, again, gauze. Let's see if there's a little list here. <clears throat> so yeah, this one, this one basically is the same kit, just with a few extras and more bandages. Um, comes with uh, irrigation bag, garbage bag. Um, again, the face shield is extra, comprehensive bandage, abdominal trauma pad, emergency blanket, gauze pads, fabric bandages, moleskins, alcohol swabs. Um, yeah, this is definitely a better kit here. Um, I like the zippers. The zippers seem like uh, they're decent quality. They can kind of hide some stuff. You could add some more to it. That's pretty key. Um, okay, so what else here? We got a pocket survival kit, comes in this nice little bag, uh, survival blanket, glow stick, mirror, whistle, paracord, ma waterproof matches, water bag, pure water purification tabs, that's a nice uh, addition there, and a survival guide, and then this is a tourniquet. So, what do I think? I think that I will be carrying the smaller kit with me. This kit uh, kind of has the basics. It's got what you need. The, uh, the biggest thing for me is lightweight and small first aid kits. They're very important, we all know that. But at what cost? We need some room on our sled or how much weight's on our backpack. <clears throat> to be honest, I would love to bring this one with me, but that takes up a lot of real estate for something that's sitting back there and hopefully doesn't get used. Um, when it does need, it, when it is needed, it, I would say, yeah, definitely, this is the kit to have out there. <clears throat> At what expense? Here's the thing. I'm a mountain rider. I'm in the backcountry. I'm lightweight. I got to do all this uh, moving around in my gear, get nice and hot and sweaty. So for me, I'm going to go with the smaller kit. And to be honest, I'll probably throw in the uh, survival kit. Although I do carry a lot of this stuff already, maybe I'll get rid of that stuff and uh, continue this and add this to uh, my kit like that, nice and compact. So yeah guys, that's uh, my review on the Wild Med Kits. Check them out, wildmedkits.ca, uh, a Canadian company, makes some good stuff and uh, yeah, be safe out there.